actually a good game today against Everton, who are surprisingly high on the table right now. Also got some big games on the horizon, so two wins to go into those matches would be really handy. Welcome to an episode of the 0708 Man United Let's Play. Let's go. What's on it, folks, and welcome to an episode, like I say, to the Manchester United 0708 Let's Play. If you're going to hit that like button down below, hit the support channel on this series. Discussion wondering, guys, what we're doing, because obviously FN25 has been extended, FN24, sorry, has been extended, FN25 has been delayed. We're doing this series on its own once. I did an update on my community section about that, so you can see what why we're doing it. It's just so we get for each series, give, series, give each series the best chance we've got of completing them. So this series first, do one season, just to get the season done. Which is which was the original plan. Then we met Bayern Munich. Then we go to Double TV. Assume we will clip, we complete the Bayern Munich series and so on and so on. So, against the camera, it's been okay. Let's take a look. So again, eight 0 win against Derby County there, which is absolutely fantastic. Um, just you know, I, I put a strong team out in that one. Um, I was going to rest players for that one, but with a result happening in with Liverpool with a draw, I decided to put the first team out to get the win. And then about sixty minutes in, when it got to like I'm not sure what the score was at sixty minutes, I took them all off just to rotate them and rest them. But we were dominant uh, in that game. Um, and then obviously you can see not in the Forest, good win there, not amazing. Terry got down a goal. Athens was okay, and then the suddenly started being weird towards the end of the match. Um, so, we are currently second in the table right now, which is fantastic. We've still got a game to play. Um, two games to, get to play. Now, of course, um, we are doing Everton and Reading today, and then we're going to come back for Liverpool and Blackburn. Um, and then we'll see where we're at in terms of at that point, and then we'll probably do Charles Camero at some. But, um, I'm worried about timing of episodes and getting things through quickly, so uh, I can't show the Champions League game. Just I want to show Liverpool, so I, I don't like doing gaps between games. You're right. For example, I don't like doing Everton, then a gap, then a live come against Roma. I just don't like that car. I lose the, the flow of the recording. So it's just my first preference. You see most of the Champions League games anyway, to be fair. So Everton, um, fourth in the table right now. We're at the top of the table. Um, we're trying this out. I think it's better. Um... Rooney's back fit, which is awesome. So Terry's on the bench for Luis Saha instead. Um, and Evra is out for, sorry, for five to seven weeks. Not ideal. We've got a special two player there, though. Um, but yeah, so we're doing one season. It's just so we can get each season, each series potentially done. Um, and having two series at once is a bit tricky to do on foot manager. Um, Let's go. I think one key highlights. I do apologise for that because I do play on key highlights off camera. Um, yeah, so Everton away from home. Tricky game, historically. Let's see how we get on today. Full of course in the team. Baines, Yobo, Tim Howard in there. So let's see how we get on. Hargreaves, scores, pace. Rooney, Rooney's on goal and he's forced a good save there for Tim Howard. I thought he was going to score that. I thought he was going to power drive as the goalkeeper. He's the corner kick now. 
Curzon was near post versus in there. Kid gigs, gigs again, back in the box. Rio Ferdinand, Scholes, Neville, Ferdinand. Oh, he's got to, he's got to shift it and get the ball in the box. He's the he's the somewhere playing right back, right wing. He's just looking at the ball and be basic with it, Rio. Just put it into danger area. Gigs called it, curls it in, cleared again. Good strong start here, but no goal yet. Ronaldo, Vidic, first time passes, no touches. Neither, Scholes, don't take too long with it. If you haven't got a pass on, play it back to play it back. Yeah, no four pass on, play it quickly backwards. Play it to Rio. Move forward, Rio. Move forward. Move forward. Move forward. Again, negative. Ronaldo. Pass back. Forward. Ronaldo. Doing well there. Bit of mistake there. Now the opponent, are yeah. Shoot. Oh, I, do, I like how they just stand and go, uh, uh, decide for something. <laughs> Don't stand there and look at them. Decide. Quick actions. Decisions quickly. You've got options. Pick one. Um, they need to be more decisive and quicker with the... They do the right thing a lot, but they take long to get there. Think of a Schneider here, long range, run a limit. Gone for it of the post, and Rio just needs to... Just, again, Rio again, trying to be too clever, just, just side foot the ball into play. Uh, he's trying to be too technical with the, with, the, with the ball, where he needs to be a bit more basic in those wide positions. But we're a bit of a team, we just can't find the goal at the minute. Um, not happy with the team. We're dominating the game, we just can't put the ball back in the net, and it's FM for you, isn't it? Score eight against Derby County when you don't need to score eight, and then they can't score one here when they need to score one. Um, just where it's going <laughs> at the moment in this game. Big kick here for Schneider. Ronaldo in the box. Ronaldo. Oh, he's. I thought he'd missed it by a long way, but he curled back in. So Rui's done nothing today, so he's coming off. Um, pause. Um, Ronaldo can come off for Nani. Scores off a carry. Just get fresh legs in those central areas. Maybe that make a difference. But knowing my get my luck on game this again. Too, too narrow. Goal. Nailed, nailed on this. There's been... Rooney's not... Any, oh, Giggs, go on, run. Rooney, get... past the ball, Giggs. Run out past the ball. Don't stand on the ball. It's not a red card, by the way. That's not a red card. Nah. That's not a red card, if... Um, you get your graphics fixed. That's not, that's not a red card. Can we get a little goal here? Giggs kills it in. Vidic! It's in! It's Vidic! It's... The first time I think we've scored a goal from a corner kick with Vidic, and it's 1-0. No, we deserve it. I mean, the 10 men may help here, and maybe helping slightly on his corner kick. Gigs with the ball on the box. Vidic are rising, rising, and then Tamal's just moved to the spot. 1-0. It's Nemanja Vidic. We'll take it. It's been deserved. Um, can we get a second one? Ball on the box again. Vidic again. Just going to yell focus at them now. I'll take 1-0 I'll take one nil here. I really will. I'll take it. Another corner kick now. All the been corner kicks at the moment now. A, a second goal would be really nice, just to make sure we get the win here. Giggs calls it in, cleared. On as far as Gary Neville, Schneider, Giggs, got time. Carrick off the post and been cleared, but just Rio again. What's he doing, Rio? Let it go out for a goal kick, Rio. Rio's been really poor today. He, he, his ball retention and decision making in those wide areas, or just generally, he's been really poor. Like he's trying to do something there, he's not on. Just let the ball go out of play, Rio. Pass the ball. Nanny. Oh, Nanny! He's starting to grow on me a bit, Nanny, now. He's starting to get a bit better with his, like, general play, which is really good to see. Um, obviously, he's not going to start many games, but... He just can't get curls in. Vidic again! And Vidic scores! Um, that's his fourth goal of the season. I don't recall him scoring goals from corner kicks before. Maybe he's scored off camera, I don't remember it. But 2-0 against Everton, really good result here. Ball in the box, Vidic flicks it on, and there's the goal. And it's nice to get goal difference a bit higher. Imagine the 8-0 against Derby County did that. But really strong performance. Just took a while to get the first goal. And definitely set pieces have definitely been a bit more of a thing in this save than they have been in any of the saves on FM this year. Um, and a bit now, of course. But yeah, a really good result. Should I have a shot? I mean, it probably should have been a lot more. But full time, Everton nil, Manchester United 2. We'll take the, we'll take the win. We'll take the win. Um, it's not important how we get them at this point. Just want to get the win. I think Liverpool have won their game anyway this week anyway. I could be wrong with that. Um, let's have a look at what the table looks like. So we have four points clear at the top, but Liverpool have got a game in hand, so they haven't played their game yet. I don't know who they're playing against either, to be honest with you. And next game is against Reading at Old Trafford in 13 days' time. So for full disclosure, I will hold you over, the get, uh, over this. Uh, I don't sit there and continue for 13 days and move an episode. Um, how was... We aren't going... How, well, this... How have how we not got, got, got a top goal scorer in there? Liverpool Aston Villa, they could drop points in that. We'll see what happens in that game. We'll keep it on screen, see what happens. 
Um, but yeah, um, just yeah, first question. I do. I don't sit here on hold. Usually, when I'm playing off camera on no, on normal games, I hold the over the actual team breaks. I don't. Oh, wage budget increased, increased transfer budget as well. Um, don't really have a plan to buy anybody in January. Um, we do have a bit more scope to do that now. The only thing I would do would be to bring in a right winger. Actually, a right back actually would be more appropriate. Um, or left back. They'll be the things I'd be more likely to bring in. So see what they see what he suggests. No one they're really standing out for me as an option. Fergie, that's not really gonna help me. Left back any, any, any options there? He likes him. And if I'm honest with you, he ain't terrible. But is he gonna is he gonna start over ever though? I don't know. Um This is the question. Um, anyway, we'll see. David Silva. Oh my God, I love, I love, I'd love to get David Silva in. Oh, David Silva on loan would be a really good idea. Optional future fee. We're not going to be. We we'll do it eighty million. You know what? Screw it, David Silva. And also, I'd love to bring in David Villa. Um, as well. David Villa could be a really good signing at striker. You know, I'm going to try and bring David Villa in. I know he's got all these clauses that much, but I'm going to try and be clever with this. With this, Pay slightly more, but instalment, and see if I can pull this deal off. Mm. Yeah, anyway, David Silver on loan could be a possibility for him very soon. Back to the game against Reading in 12 days' time. David Silva, David Silva is joining on loan. Um, just a bit of extra quality, you know, for Champions League purposes, potentially, if we get out of the group, of course. I think if we beat Roma, we'll get out of the group, honestly. I think we will. I'm looking at the fixtures, looking at the fixtures, actually, after this. I've got, which are higher? Who's, who's higher? Portsmouth or Blackburn? Blackburn are higher. So, it makes sense. Well, it's not by much. Anyway, building at Old Trafford, this should be a win. Um, this should be a win. Um, Liverpool have dropped points as well. Arsenal, we can go four months clear at the top here. This is a big game. Now, this obviously is similar to what happened against Derby County when a team dropped points behind us and I went for the first team. Um, I'll need a rest, so put Nandy out. Just because Nandy needs a rest, so that's the reason why he's not playing. Actually, he's given a complete rest, actually, so he's not actually in the team at all. And then um, the team's going to be, I'm going to be the first 11. I ain't changing anything. Um, I want to get this win. Um, to get four points clear with everyone on the same points of the same games is really important for me and generally should be important everybody really is point so yeah um, the reason why I'm bringing in David Silva is because when I wish Schneider is good but when I play Anderson he's not quite there that quality yet and it'd be great to be able to rotate Silva and Anderson plus I'd like to bring them both in if I possibly can anyway gigs on the ball now let's see what happens Hargreaves Vidic Good ball. Giggs flicks it through towards Rooney. Doesn't get there. Pressure on the ball. Long ball. Trusher. Giggs. There you go back as you have to. Play for the gap. Throw it over the top. Ah, negative. Play it over the top. They're playing a higher line. Play it over the top. No. Play it over the top. Stop going short when there's options down the line. How goes? Play it. Again, safe pass all the time. Move forward, Rio. There's no pressure on the ball. Move forward. He don't want to do it, does he, Rio? Nani. Schneider shoots. Rio, move forward with the ball. When, they, when, they, when if they're not, if they're not going to put pressure on you, move forward with it. Neville. Nani. Schneider. Rooney. Oh, should have been a goal. Again, Rooney. Work rate. Work harder. Giggs. Nani. Oh, well done, Nani. Doing really well here. Rooney off the post. Why am I trying to so bad in front of goal? Like, they, they work as players and they cannot score goals on consistent basis. I made a slight tweet to go for more direct passes and more crosses. And Schneider scores! Manchester United won, Reading nil, finally got the goal. Um, I've just got more direct because I think working the box doesn't really work on foot manager. It just makes players, it makes players just take the piss and just don't actually go for goals. They go for passes more than like trying to be more direct and get the goal when they need, when, when, when they can. Uh, but one no, Roger Schneider. Um, what a signing he's been. I'm so happy we signed him. He's been really. He took a while to get going, 
But he's, he's going now. And there's another fight right, right way now. Schneider again on the ball. Heavily involved. Gary Neville down the line. Nani. Can he find a cross? He can. The far post. Geeks can't miss. 2 0. Keeper made a massive mistake there. He completely, completely misjudged the ball over the top. Um, I mean, it's nice play from Gary Neville here down the right hand side. And Nani here just puts the ball in the box. Not an not amazing ball, but look at the keeper. Reggie's messed up and Giggs was thank you very much on his left foot, 2-0. That's the goal I was looking for. I really wanted to see. Just to make sure that three points are coming back. Still at Old Trafford, in theory. Now hopefully we get some more. Don't get in, cross it in. Nani. Down the right. Cut back inside. Well done. Pass it. Well done. Perfect. Everything was perfect from, from Nani there. Giggs. Down line to the Vesta. Oh, really can't miss. Strikers are not good on this database for me. My strikers do not want to put ball back in the net. Gigs with a corner kick. Close it in. Cleared. Vidic. Keep it in play. First time pass. No, oh, never mind. Half time. Comfortable result, comfortable, comfortable result again so far. Uh, we just got to maintain our focus. Um, strikers, however, do not want to score goals. Um, they get too many chances and they miss too many of them. Um, but 2 0 up, a third goal, because I'm making changes for the games coming up soon. Roman Mendes is the main one I'm thinking about. I want to get a third goal here and then start taking players off. Vidic, Silvestre. No, the ball wasn't on. I'm off, I'm off for going forward passes, but not when it's not on. Like, the force passes that are, on, are not on when. The force passes that. that can't talk. They play a pass that's not on when they should play a safe one. Then play a safe one when a pass is on that's more aggressive and just duck out of it. Like, that's a risky pass. Never. Please don't have the FM25 like that when the keeps shooting. Gary Neville. Hargreaves. Gary Neville. Nani. Gary Neville. Nani. Giggs. Sylvester. Oh, he scored. Oh, not, you can't give off sides and there's no one near the ball. Can stop it. There's no, not interfering with the ball, man. Not interfering with the ball. Yeah. If it's what I think is giving off the check-in, I don't think the guy's interfering with, with the play at all. No. He can't kind of get there anyway. It doesn't matter what happens with that. So, yeah, 3-0. Right. With that in mind, we now make changes. Terrace comes on. Anderson comes on. Uh, Houston Park comes on, Darren Fletcher comes on, and that will do for now. Guy never can come off as well for John O'Shea. Just bear, bear in mind, we've got Roman next. That's a big game. We're going to, I wanted to rest players. We're filling up in this game. Should be game over. So, got a highlight here now. Just making a change from attacking to positive so we can ease up a little bit. Tevez, good ball to Houston Park. Can they find a pass or a shot? He's an on goal. Houston Park! Didn't expect him to score, but he did the right thing by shooting when he got in that position. And then corner kick curls it in. O'Shea's in there, and that's a penalty. Nearly on penalty, it's a push. They always give them. Now, who's taking the penalty? Who's taking the penalty? It's Anderson. I'm not sure how good he's at penalties. That's not bad. Manchester United 4, Reading 0, and this is really good. Again, it's just... When we do get a good lead, we seem to just drive it home with more goals. And it's 4 0 now. And again, the goal difference would be like plus pushing. It might be pushing plus 40 now, honestly, at this point. Uh, it was 29, I'm sure, recently. But we'll have a look at it after the game. Nani. This could be more. And this, we're not. I, I'm, I'm not even kidding you. Nani. Deflected. Ooh, that could have been disastrous for them. Obviously, not us. But Connor Kicks were good at these. Say good. We're okay at these. Born the box. Cleared. Tevez hit it. I don't know why he took a touch for there. He's like he's it's like he's got to try and make the perfect opportunity rather than oh god, I have a chance here to get a shot on goal. It's like hit the shot, bro. It's four 0 Be more aggressive with your shooting. Vidic and nah, we've got to play. But yeah, four 0 It's been a great great performance. Well, it's gonna be four 0 unless they get a late goal right at the end here, which I don't think they're going to. Um Convey down the left hand side, kills it in, and that's been cleared. Do some part full time Manchester United four. Reading nil at full time. Perfect score. Two really good results. Just the only difference was in the first game we struggled to score. And this get early on this game, we managed to get the first one kick on, get second one quite quickly. Very good result there. Delighted with that score line. Very pleased with that. So next episode, um 
there's not much in it in terms of who's playing where. So we're just going to do the which game? Show, which game? Uh, which game? Uh, I don't want to do. Tell you what, we'll do Portsmouth and Liverpool because then that gives me a gap of game, and then we can see about Schalke after that and see where we're at with all the rest of it. So Roma off camera um, probably. Will be just me showing you the result most likely because um, there's no guarantee. I'm not going to record it because it might be new. If it's new, nil, there's no point recording it. Um, it's, and it's just awkward. It's one goal. It's a very weird thing to do. So we'll do Porsche because Porsche was an interesting game because Porsche is, you know, tricky game for United in the past. Obviously, Liverpool then adds on people to watch if it's a bit longer to get the Liverpool match. Um, and then we'll see where we're at in terms of get that point. We'll probably do a shower come next time after that. Um, and then we'll see. So. I'll see you guys tomorrow for more. If you're excited, hit the like button down below. Subscribe if you're new as well. Don't forget to check out the Let's channel down below. And I'll catch you guys all in the next video. Until then, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.